Hi, my name is DJ and I'll be narrating for a group's health video. During this video, I'll be discussing the nutritional benefits of our meal of choice. I caught this guy at my local McDonald's and this is what I cooked. A hash brown and orange juice and a sausage and egg McGriddle. First, let's take a look at the McGriddle. Even though it's such a small sandwich, the McGriddle is packed with lots of fat, calories, carbs, protein, and cholesterol. The sandwich takes about 81% of your daily cholesterol intake and 40% of your daily protein intake. Although the sandwich does contain eggs, which are really high in protein, eggs are also really high in cholesterol, which could lead to future heart problems. The next item in our McGriddle is the sausage. The sausage doesn't really have any good nutritional value. It lacks lots of vitamins and minerals like calcium, iron, and vitamin A. It also contains upwards of 15 grams of fat. The McGriddle is nearly all negative. There are extreme amounts of fat, carbs, and calories. And the protein isn't necessarily bad for you, but unless you do some sort of workout, the protein will turn into fat. Although the worst part about the McGriddle is that it's not that filling even though it's about 22% of your daily RDIs. The next item on our list is the orange juice. The orange juice isn't necessarily bad for you, but it does contain a lot of sugar and a lot of vitamin C. Orange juice takes around 55% of your daily sugar intake. And that's only one serving size of the drink. Most people have two to three glasses. And with the McGriddle, you're getting 40 grams of sugar in your meal. Our last item on our menu is the hash brown. The hash brown isn't terribly unhealthy for you, but it contains a lot of sodium, which could end up leading to high blood pressure and possibly a heart attack later in life. Overall, this is a pretty unhealthy meal. It contains almost all the recommended doses of added sugars, fats, and protein. It's also really high in cholesterol and sodium, which could lead to a future heart attack. It also accounts for 36% of your daily RDIs. Although the worst part about this meal is it's not really that filling. Most people will take another hash brown, or maybe another glass of orange juice. Also, you're getting a lot of empty calories. Lastly, the food comes from McDonald's, who are known for putting chemicals and hormones in their food to make them stay fresh longer and taste better. This meal should be eaten very rarely because of all the excess nutrients you're getting from it.